Hey guys, what's going on? It's your first thing you here, and today I'm going to be discussing the drawing I'm drawing today, as I did in my last video. Um, so, the person I'm drawing today is uh, none other than Seth of the Hype Man, Seth N16 Gaming, Seth of the no, 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 you all know him, you all love him. Um, <laughs> so, ironically, I've been drawing for Seth since 2017, that's when I first drew him. Um, he was a friend of a friend, and he was having openings for voice actors. So I auditioned, and I made him cry. <laughs> uh, great icebreaker, by the way. Just make make a make, make the person that's gonna be in charge of you uh, cry. <laughs> uh, afterwards, I started drawing for him, and little by little, uh, I now draw his character way more than I draw my own character. Uh. Seth's character design uh, for his persona has changed so much ever since I started drawing him. When I first started drawing him, he was very pale, had black hair, it was very, you know, very fluffy. He had a lightning, blue lightning thing going on, and then he changed it. <laughs> right after I drew him in one of my pictures, he immediately was like, oh, I'm changing designs. So he went from, I believe, a blue to like a gold, and then he went, went from gold to like a purple, and now he's trying to go for like a, a very deep red. And I admire that. I admire when people try and change things up, make stuff look different. But my guy, I can only hold on for so long, my dude. <laughs> um, I try to challenge myself this time, and instead of trying to, oh, redesign it, remake it, perfect. No, I challenged myself to draw this in under 30 minutes. The sketch, everything. So everything you see here is done in actually like 25 minutes, I believe. Oh my goodness, I was so stressed afterwards. Um, you'll see in the final product, but it looks, it looks nice. It looks decent. It's just, mm, I was trying to make sure it didn't look too 3D-ish. Uh, I did go for the single color for line art though I went for the brown I just think so I think it looks nicer versus you know using black because brown just looks it brings everything more together it's more of like a hushed tone than black is because black is very vibrant it's a saturated color by nature um I used a bunch of old colors from his previous so his previous color was purple uh, so I used it in his headphones um, I used the same jacket, I just changed the color of it. And for his hair, oh my god. I I don't have a set design for Seth's hair. He changes he changes his style every now and again, so I change his hairstyle to mimic that. Um, but he has very short hair. I don't normally draw short hair. I usually just draw like really curly hair, but I did give it the anime -esque that it needed and it turned out pretty pretty well for design wise. Uh, not gonna lie, I, I come I'm turning my head, it kinda looks like an onion a bit. <laughs> so I wanna do that's what you're getting. Uh, I tried to get go way more for an anime vibe. Uh, the reference picture in the corner I used, I saw it and I'm like, that's a Seth face. That is definitely Seth to a T, my guy. To a T. Um, <laughs> there's not that much to say about it though. It's just, uh, it's a basic portrait. Um. I try to I try to like avoid three quarter views, but it's the only view that I'm really good at drawing, as well as any other artist can tell you. Three quarter view is the place to be at when it comes to just drawing in general. Um, his smile was a bit bigger than what I normally do. I always do a smirk for my characters, or like you know, a, a, just a nice gentle smile. Doing big grins is really hard to do on my on my half and i hope to improve on that uh one thing i did enjoy though is uh i took geometry in school uh and i figured out how to make uh circles into curves um so i was able to use that when making the headphones uh a bit more details i put in was uh obviously the the jacket um pulley things i don't know what those are called you know the strings that everyone just pulls on i don't like those <laughs> They're there to like secure the hood, but it's just I don't ever use them because I have too big of a head. Um, I I was gonna just go for honestly just cell shading for the whole thing and just call it good, but I'm like I must add more details. I know it's supposed to be a quick draw, but I got time. 
and I looked over the footage at the final and it's like, yo, 25 minutes. And I'm like, oh shit. So I guess the speed paint just proves, hey, it's okay to take your time. And if you speed through it, it's going to look like this. In my own opinion, I don't, I don't think it looks very good, but to others, they might enjoy it. Um, so I hope you don't mind I used you, Seth. I didn't ask permission necessarily, but I don't think you'd mind. And if you do, then I'll probably just delete the video, not gonna lie. Um, yeah, there's not... <laughs> there's not much to say more about the drawing, but honestly, Seth is an awesome person. He started streaming a couple months ago. Uh, so he has a streamer schedule, I believe. And honestly, one of the major reasons why I decided to draw Seth was because I miss him. He recently got his computer fried and he's trying to save up for a new one so that way we can get started with uh, more... Sorry, my, my, my origin just went off. Uh, he's trying to... Stop it! I don't want to play Apex. Um, he started to save, he's starting to save up for a new computer in order to be able to do what he, what he does best. Gaming, etc. Um, I'm not sure if there's a link or not for Kickstarter for his computer. I can't remember if there is. If there is, I'll put it in the description. But, uh, yeah, that's all for me, guys. Uh, I'll see you guys next week with another video. Uh, hopefully I can get an actual schedule started, but I'm not sure. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you have, make sure to leave a record clock, and I'll see you guys in the next video.